What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Smile Mob Podcast. I'm your host Half Deezy and today we're going to be diving into some rumors that have been floating around about Takashi 6 9 and P. Diddy kicking it in prison. Now you already know I had to get to the bottom of this so let's break it down. First off, no, Takashi 6 9 and P. Diddy are not hanging out in prison. They're both located at the Metropolitan Detention Center. Takashi's lawyer Lance Lazaro made it perfectly clear that Takashi 69 is being held in solitary confinement. And in my opinion, that's not really any type of special treatment, at least not in my book. But the whole reason behind it is to keep high profile inmates like himself fully protected safe now Takashi may not like being necessarily locked up but his team is just saying that he's trying to make it through now let's talk about why Takashi is in this mess to begin with now the judge laid down the law after Takashi pled guilty to violating a supervised release we're talking about unsupervised trips to Las Vegas right here in the city we talking about Florida missing drug tests to be honest he's also been failing those drug tests with his probation officer this dude is wilding out I guess it's not no surprise, right? Now, for all of that, Takashi only has to do 30 more days in jail, and then he's gonna be released for home restriction. Can you believe that? Home restriction. Currently, right now, he's got one more month of home detention and one more month of loser detention. Loser. And then he's got about a month on curfew, which I'm sure he's gonna violate that too. It sounds like this young man is gonna have a whole lot of time to think about his next moves. Hopefully, the smart ones. Now, meanwhile, Diddy's locked up in the same facility at MDC, but he's on another level. And right now, he's facing allegations, and the legal battle that he has ahead of him looks way more grim than Takashi 69's little violations. But at the same time, it's pretty crazy to see two huge names like that locked up at the same facility. These cases right here, both of them, highlight that just because you're successful doesn't mean you get any kind of special treatment or that you're exempt from your consequences. Whether it's court violations or serious allegations, the court has its eyes set on these two guys. My take on it, Takashi 69 better keep his head down and follow the rules, which he probably won't. He's been given another chance, which he's been given multiple chances to get it right. But the question is, Will he take it and actually straighten his life out? And as for Diddy, that's a whole nother can of worms that we're going to be keeping our eyes on. So stay tuned. Now let me know in the comments. Do you think that Takashi is going to take this chance and actually make better for his life? Or is he just going to spiral out of control again? And as for Diddy, how do you think that's all going to play out? Go on ahead and let me know with your comments down below. That's it for the episode today of Smile My Podcast. I'm a half DZ. Thanks for tuning in. Make sure you like, share, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you can be updated on all hip-hop and culture right here.